Kill him. Kill him. Attack. Good morning. Happy rainy ass Monday. Say good morning to all your friends. Good morning, friends. She's gonna brush my face. So this is part of our morning routine. Not do it every morning, because sometimes I'm running a little late. I take a makeup wipe remover cotton round. I dry his face. Well, he's gonna move and I don't have a tripod, so. I just dry his face, because he has tears. We dry your tears away. And then I take a small face brush. And I brush out the buggies after he's done digging through the couch. You good? Clean face. And I just kind of move any hairs that are like pointing, poking in his eye. I need to get scissors so I can groom your face. I just got this Pure Paws Reconstructing Shine Spray. Spray it on a small slicker brush because I cannot find my big pin brush right now. And then I corral the pup. Come here, my bubbles, and I just give him a quick brush through. At night, I like go all the way in, but just super quick. That's all I do, super easy, because I did not give him a full brushing. Don't eat your hair that I just dropped on the floor. I didn't like do a good <laughs> brushing last night, so I just alternate. So if I like brush him out hardcore in the evening, I just kind of do his face in the morning if I have time. If not, I just do it when I get home. And since I did a half ass brush through, I'll do a real one tonight. I completely forgot to say that today is gonna be the best Monday of all time. I don't know if it's gonna be the best day ever. I hate going back to work after vacation. I'm grateful that I have a job but I feel like I need one more day to like recover and sleep. I didn't keep up with my email while I was away, so I probably have 800 kajillion emails to sort and delete and go through and catch back up with. And I think there's a board meeting today, but I'm not on the board. It doesn't matter that I dress like crap and it's raining out, so. But I was kind of mad, well not mad, but I, I'm i really bad. Like if I'm on vacation, like I don't really like check my phone every five minutes, my work phone. And I checked it when I was on the way to Savannah and it was like, oh, like I don't wanna make fun. <laughs> we had to do, I was asked to do this project that was due at end of business that day and I was like, Hey, I'm on vacation and I'm literally not home. Can I just give it to you on Monday? And my boss was like, no. So I guess whatever information they needed is for the board meeting today. So I was like, well, I'm gonna be in the car for the whole day, so I'll get it when I get it. But I did it and she said thank you, so I appreciate that she thanked me for you know taking time out of my vacation because it took like two hours and I filled out like a miss punch form because I feel like since I'm not salary that if I work when I'm on vacation especially for an hour two hours that I should either get two hours of PTO back or get paid so I need to check my electronic time thing and make sure that it was put in because I just don't work for free. I used to do it and I don't know, I just feel like it's there's no point. Like why work for free when at the end of the day, nobody cares. But I will work for coins. So yeah, I filled out a sheet and I said, hi, I'm on vacay. Let me get my coins. I flat ironed my hair this morning and it's raining, so I don't know why I did that. That's because it was still kind of wet last night, so I wrapped it. I did like I brushed it all the way around and I, I wrapped it, but I did a really bad job, so it was like sticking out everywhere. So I just did a quick little flat iron and I need to get my hair done again. I think I'm just gonna get new hair because 
this hair is so damaged from bleaching it twice. So I do like the color, so I'm gonna bleach it just one time. I have to call my stylist and see when she's free. She's always booked because she's the best. If you're in the area, her name is Tiffany. You can look on her Facebook. I have it linked on the description bar down there. It's Beautiful Hair by Tiffany and she is in Smyrna, Georgia. She's totes worth it. We should call Brandy Barron and tell her, good morning. I don't think she'll appreciate that because she's not working today. What you looking for, Bubba? I took his bully stick from him when he was paying, he wasn't paying attention. I was taking him out of his kennel, crate, kennel, whatever. And he's been looking for it for like five minutes and I kind of feel kind of bad. He like went back in, turned everything upside down, but it's right here. It's so gross. It's a bull's penis, but it's dehydrated. He loves it. It's getting kind of short. I don't want him to see it. It's getting kind of short. <laughs> no pun intended. I have like a new one ready, but I kind of like him to only have them when I'm not home, but not for a long period of time because he could choke or hurt himself. Are you sitting pretty because you want something? Can you sit? Lay down. Nope. Lay down. Roll. You know what we're gonna do? Do you know, Bobas? We're going to wash your face with soap, with puppy face soap, because your face is dirty. I don't think you need a full bath, so we'll just half-ass it. We'll, we'll wash you up. It's the zoomies. Whenever I catch him, he stops. Zoom bubbles be free. Oh, you got my keys. Oh, look at. Go ahead. I dare you. I dare you. If you value it, don't put it on the floor. Hence the shoes and the shoes. Oh, you got Piggy? What you gonna do with Piggy? This is how Piggy ended up in the toilet the other night. You love Piggy. Get it. Flip it. Kill him. Kill him. Attack. Kill. 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 Attack. Kill. Kill him. Attack. Fight. Uh-uh, honey. If you knock that water bowl over, I will bust you upside the head. I will bust you upside your head. Oh, it's empty. This is new, honey. I got this at TJ Maxx. Two ninety nine. You jelly? Are you jelly? Are you jelly jelly? Jelly 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 jelly. You want some water? Even though he knows he has water right here, maybe he wants. There you go. Fine, we'll get you some spoiled ass dog water. You're bougie. Tap is not good enough for my dog. He needs to drink the finest water. Distilled water. From Walmart. Supposedly, which supposedly is not a word, but I'm only gonna give him like, not a whole bowl because it's 9.30. So he can just have some. Mmm, water. Supposedly filtered and distilled water helps with tear stains because minerals is found in tap water that can contribute to tear staining. Research is not conclusive, but I figured YOLO and a gallon of water literally lasts him 
almost a month. Maybe not a month, but it lasts a really long time. And they're like less than a buck. And then we have a backup. So if there's ever like an emergency, I'll have jugs of water. Yeah, they actually took my garbage today. Thanks. I think the garbage, like the Valley Trash people hate me. Like they skipped, they legit skipped me yesterday. I was like, what did I ever do to y'all? Light a candle for peace and serenity. There's nothing in there for you, my boys. We have to clean up. Do you want to help me clean? Clean up. Clean up. Put your toys away. It's so hot in here. Okay, let's not get crazy. I want to change this. I don't know what I want to change it to. What do you want to do, Bubbles? I got mail! That was so corny. I checked my P.O. box. I've been meaning to go there for like so long. It's just, it's just in, not inconvenient, but I don't know. I could just never get there. And then when I went there last week, I didn't have my key to my P.O. box. Fail. But I got some love. I received a rack. So thank you so much. I cheated and I did open it. And I love, like please, if you wanna send me something, send me a note, a card, a letter, a love letter, postcard, anything like that. So I got a really, really super sweet card. And it's from Linz31. And she sent me some goodies and some super kawaii envelopes. She just took so much attention and care and that's so nice. And just little thingies for my Filofax and planning. So thank you so much, girlfriend. Oh, and these awesome like note divider things that stick. I love anything that is organized and sticks. Love it. And Ms. Christine, it's my P.O. box, not my address. <gasps> Thank you so much for your letter. I need to write you back. I got a new phone. We didn't even talk about that. I got the Verizon. The Verizon. I got the LG G3. And I'm in love. I had the Galaxy S3. <laughs> I actually kept the phone for two years and that never happens. But I love it. It's hella big. It's not as big as I thought it would be because I didn't play around with it before I got it. Cause it was on sale, $99 on lunch day. They're having this huge sale at Verizon. And I love it. Cause I really wanted and I was waiting for the Galaxy S5, but Samsung is dumb and they won't release it in a 32 GB model and I need all the memory I could get. It's kind of weird cause I had the old S5 wallpaper on my S3, and I like the look of it, and I hate the dash widget that came with this phone. So I downloaded HD widgets from the Android market, and I made it look like the way I want it. I'll probably change the wallpaper soon. I'll have one of the pictures my bulbs. I set it up, and then I can just tap her and call her. It has some super awesome features. It has a quick remote, and you can set it up to all the TVs in your house. Like, okay, let's try living room right now my tv is muted and i just hit this button and nothing happened nothing happened again it usually works well you know what whatever it freaking worked yesterday oh i'm probably not pointing it at the right place well things always fail when you're trying to get ish done so i'm gonna call it a night because i think i blabbed about nothing okay my bubbles Hi! You wanna say bye to all your friends? Bye guys. Um, I'm gonna get a bath. I'm doing better with them, so it's cool. Bye. Bye guys. Bye!